Hello everyone and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. In this video I'll be showing you how to make an automatic music disc sorter. Now that's a name for a contraption that tells you exactly what it does. You can see it in front of me right here. Behind here is also a creeper farm and a contraption to kill them with a skeleton so that the discs will drop into this item elevator which brings the gunpowder and discs up here into our contraption. Now the gunpowder is already sorted out so for this contraption to work you're going to need nothing but discs coming into this part of the system right here. Now this contraption requires the user's participation which means you have to stand here holding down right click to sort out all your records into the correct chest and there is a way to do this automatically AFK as well which means you can leave your computer and this will continuously run. So we need to grab a record for me to show you how to do this and we need to be in game mode zero. So now all the player is going to do is hold down right click and you're going to see that the minecart will go and drop that off to the correct chest. When it comes back we are given another disc which immediately goes back into the jukebox and this process will repeat itself over and over again and it will correctly sort all of the records into the correct chests. Now there is one way that this can go wrong and that is if you actually uh, don't leave enough space in these chests so if the records fill up then they'll end up going into the wrong chest like the next one along. So that's one way that it can break but otherwise it sorts them all perfectly and you can see from this test that I've done that we've had no problems whatsoever apart from a couple of them that filled up and I saw that that meant the record would go into the next chest over but otherwise it sorts them with no problems. Now this video is a tutorial and the tutorial part will actually require you to check out two other videos. You can find links to them in the description box below and a link to the farm in which you can see right here. This has actually been modified since I showed that so I wanted to take the opportunity to talk about that a little bit. A lot of people commented that the farm that I originally built which was all the way down at bedrock could actually build a little bit higher up. So it's in the second sub chunk and this means that the spawn rates are going to be halved however it's still a really large amount of creepers that it's spawning and because they don't have to go up a water elevator and they fall straight down this is actually probably a better way to build the farm. It means you're going to have to do less digging downwards overall. Now one comment I will make is that when you have a lot of creepers in here it works just fine. When there's only a few at this height for some reason they always fight the water current so it's not until you've got a lot of them in here um, that they start to actually shuffle out which is really strange behavior to see that I wanted to comment on and also if you did see that other video I mentioned that when you build this higher up the creepers like to come and stand in the corner that's another problem with doing it at this height but anyway the creepers drop down this contraption at the bottom kills them so if you're thinking of building this sorter you might want to build that farm so you've automatically got record discs coming into the system. Now this will produce record discs faster than you can sort them but you know they're, they're pretty much infinite at this point so loss isn't really a problem. So then what we have is an item elevator to bring those items up. They go into a chain of hoppers. This right here will sort out all of the gunpowder and then the only thing that's going through into this part of the system are the discs themselves. So now it's time for the tutorial part of this video and I'm going to show you how to modify this contraption to turn it into an automatic sorter. The reason why is because I've already done a tutorial on how to build this. This is from my automatic jukebox video. So you can find a link to that in the description box down below. You can use that tutorial to build this yourself and then I'll show you how to modify it as there's no point me repeating uh, something that I've already done. But this contraption, if you haven't seen it before, allows you to pick a record that you want to listen to, put it in over here, enjoy the records and then when you're done you click on that and it goes and puts it into the correct chest for you which is pretty fantastic right well what we're doing is simply modifying this to automate that process so we can stand here holding down right click so back here is the modified version of the contraption all there is is a couple of little bits of redstone attached on the side here that bring a signal around from the main delay of this contraption they add some more delay bring it around to the front so that it will simply power the dropper and give you a new record when the time is right for you to put it back into the jukebox so you've watched the other video you follow the tutorial you've built the contraption and now you're ready to modify this well you're going to need the materials that you see on my hotbar down here and building it is very simple we want a block right there we want to come underneath this and place a row of blocks like a so that one is not necessary and then come out by one and make this shape and remove that block there now we put all the blocks in place 
for the redstone to be attached. We want a redstone torch here, a repeater, this one on the fourth setting, this one here on the third setting. If you set it to the fourth, it doesn't actually work, work which is a little bit of a quirk that I can't really explain, to be fair. Um, so another one there on the fourth setting, and our last one goes over here again on the fourth setting. We put our second redstone torch right here, and then we can come round to this bit, stand here, and put in the dropper facing us so that we can stand in that gap, receive the records when we're facing the jukebox. Then above it, a hopper and a dropper, and, and then you can attach a line of hoppers in into here from wherever your discs are coming from. So the next part of the tutorial is about how you trick your game into thinking you're holding down right click. This involves going into your controls, changing your right click key, and then using full screen to uh, trick the game into thinking you're holding down right click while you're on the jukebox. So then it continuously um, gives you records and sorts all of them out. And again, I made a tutorial video on how to do this that goes into uh, a lot of detail on how you do the trick and you can find that linked down below and that is the last part that you need. So once you build this contraption, it's hooked up, you need to learn how to do the AFK trick. Then all you got to do is get a record in hand, stand here, make sure there's records in the dropper behind you, hold down right click, do the AFK trick and then your contraption is all ready to go. So that's it from me this video. If you've enjoyed it, leave a like. As always, thank you for your support. And there is a world download available for you in the description box down below. If you'd like to jump into this world and give it a whirl, then you can do so. One thing I will say, though, is make sure you clear out these chests, because once they fill up, um, it's going to go into the next one along. But yes, that's it from me this video. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.